Ever since I started writing a daily journal, which was almost four years ago, I've been conscious of documenting my life and the experiences that are shaping me as a person. Travelling is one of my passions, and last year, on our first trip to Prague in the Czech Republic, I kept a small notebook for ticket stubs, receipts, and other ephemera from our trip. This year, I decided to do it again. And now that I finally have some time to put it all together, I thought I would share the process with you. This is a simple, plain field notes. I chose it because I have them to hand, it's high quality paper, and it should be more than large enough for all the items I got from our trip. While I had started to stick some items into the book while we were in Prague, the majority of them were loose. The first step is to organize and sort them all by day so that I can add them to the book sequentially. I kept a wide variety of items, subway tickets, restaurant receipts, pencil purchases, business cards, anything that would help illustrate the story of our trip. It's not just a folder for old ticket stubs though. Part of the story comes from what I choose to write on the pages. The anecdotes, the personal experience. Memory will fade with time, but hopefully I can infuse these pages with even a taste of the excitement and enjoyment that we had while we were traveling. I purchased the glue in the first day of our trip, along of course with some pencils. Even though this trip was just last month, I still needed to translate a few of the receipts from Czech just to remember what I actually bought and where from. This is why we write things down. The purpose is not to be stylized or fanciful. I'm not using coloured pens or washi tape. This is an analogue account of our travels, a vault for the paper ephemera that normally gets destroyed when you clear out your pockets. Think less scrapbooking grandmother and more Charles Darwin's accounts on his travels on the Beagle. The notebook is really, really important because it gives what would normally be considered junk a format and a structure. I don't want an envelope full of random receipts and ticket stubs. I do want a curated collection of memories and experiences. I didn't keep everything I had collected and some of the stuff didn't make it into the finished book. That's just part of the process. It shouldn't just be packed with pointless receipts or worthless documentation. I only kept the things that reminded me of amazing places we visited, delicious meals we had eaten, or interesting people we met. Photos are great, and video is amazing, but sometimes I yearn for something solid. Something that isn't filed away in a Facebook photo album, or saved on an external hard drive. Something I can touch, read, feel. Sometimes, paper is better. <laughs>